Kira kira haramai, greetings and welcome. We're in Providence Ridge with the last one standing, playing the maximum zombie plus 1000% mod on top of lethal zone. So basically 10 times the normal number of zombies. Now the game can't actually handle all that, uh, those many zombies at the same time. So we may end up in a situation where they just continually spawn on our, situ on our location. So uh, big trouble, big trouble. All right, we've got a mission coming in. What do you think? Uh, so, anyway, we'll talk about that mission in a moment. Last episode, we managed to move down to Rusty Rosie's and we managed to get our morale problem under control. We're only depressed. Only depressed. So we built a lounge because it gave us a bed and something to push back against that. Um, we've got a couple empty outpost slots that we can use. Uh, we probably need more food because we are like chomping through it and um, we're working on preparing a feast for the morale bonus as well then we might try rationing or something um i actually we should probably do that uh we're okay i think rationing will push us down again so we'll that's two minutes that's three minutes we might be all right no we're not we can't afford to waste food like that so we're stopping that but we are pushing on with the lounge we have a mission to talk to these new guys in town. The Welcome Wagon for Marquis. Right and um, yeah, that's that's doable. We've got happy campers um, and the rest of the map is going to be horribly covered in zombies. But that's all good. And Wade's stash is to create um, to talk to Wade. No, take control of Wade. So here's our... Um, here is our community. So we've got Adrian, one of the originals. Um, and we've recently recruited two of the three booze hounds, which we got. And we let one of one of our chemists go because he was just causing all sorts of problems. We do have hygiene. Super important. Um, what is Wade's Yo, state of... You can spare it. Yeah. Yeah, we could definitely do with that. So what we'll do... And fill her up. Well, we do have fuel, so we can do that as well. So... Let's put Minerva away because Minerva is a very important character. And we'll give her the... Uh, ooh, do we give her the Viper with its 357? No, we'll hold on to that. We'll give her the Damage Carbine. Yeah, tell you what, we are really low. That's our bandage. Um, uh, the community bandage. And we'll switch to Wade. Something personal has come up. We All right. Focus on it. Oh, he's actually using a KSG. Oh. That's That's awesome. I do like me a KSG. And we're going the wrong way. What's up, Buttercup? What's up, Buttercup? And, One second. and she's using uh, M4A1, which is all good. And we'll just swap out here. So we do have a crossbow. We'll take that. But the light crossbow will take some painkillers. We'll just take two. So that we can stack them. We'll take all our snacks just because we can. We will take crossbow bolts. We will take a plague cure. Morale is now stable. That's the best it's been since we started this game. And uh, we're also joined by my cat. Who uh, would not let me close the office door. <laughs> so if you hear a meowing cat, that's what it is. Right, uh, right, that should probably do us. Oh, wow. Things have gotten better already, straight away from the improved morale. In lethal zone, it is actually really important. Um, so we'll need to get down. Okay, our vehicle is trash. We know this. We'll probably do with a gas can. Or we should take some fire. Looks like a juggernaut, only nastier. Look, we got some stims and stuff, so we're almost all good to go after a heart. But we're a little vulnerable. We're a little vulnerable. All right, how's the gas situation? It's actually not bad, but we'll whack that in there. And let's head down. I don't think we've got anything to trade, but we will look at doing that if we've got something. Oh, yeah, we've got low-tar cigarettes, and we got that crap thing. All right. Um... 
whack that in there. And let's blow this joint. Now, got Wade's stash in there. We'll, okay, so we'll do a bit of a drive-by there on the way through. So we'll get a kind of handle for what we're up against when we're in the main town. I do like the Providence Ridge Mag. It's nice. It's got lots of variety. It's got uh, reasonably urban areas dotted all over the map of different flavors. Yikes. That is raspberry flavored. Um, and, you know, so there's not a lot of dead space on the map. This is where T-Dog used to leave the drugs for me. All right. Oh, we haven't started the... Uh, Mission yet. Oh, minus four food. Look at that. Ouch. Kept their license. Yeah, we have to do something about that. Oh, am I using my. Have I started doing that again? Yeah, nah. I'm just going to get used to not using the map marker. That way I'll just get better at knowing what, what the map is like, you know? Okay, we're just going to quietly exit out of here and hope these guys do not see me they can hang around my car that's fine because they'll get bored and they'll head off somewhere now I left the stuff to trade in the car but that's okay now we want to talk to where's the dude Gomez um, Gomez get in here you might want to swing by and say hi to your other neighbors they're friendly enough, I guess. Okay. We can do that. Oh, hey. Let's tackle. Sounds what do you like got? a plan. Bullets. Yep. Not a moment too soon. Uh, what are those? C4 charges? Yeah, yeah. No, nah, we, we haven't got them. We haven't got the influence for that. Congrats. You're still alive. These guys look new. Wow. Uko is tough. That's a tank right there. So Uko's a tank. Oops. Hey. Mahina is not a tank. Hygiene, that's all right. We've got that covered. Hey. And here comes a zombie. So watch yourself, buddy. Oops. Sounds like we attracted attention. So they should be able to handle that because they look pretty tough. Um, I'm not sure where that thing is. Oh, there, there it be. Aim for the head. Weird. Leader of the trusty townies. So who are these guys? You might go help them. Oh man, they got this. Over here. I need a breather. Already? Ooh. Easy tiger. Yep, there are a lot of zombies. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's gonna that's gonna bring so many zombies. It's not funny. We're gonna get out of here. Because there is naught to be gained. But we'll see what this next kind of mission is. Those guys. Okay. We might bring them a zombie just in case. Wow. Alright, well this mission's kind of cool. Because it's popping up. It's popping up enclaves on the map. And we do want friends. We will need friends. No 
Don't see it. All right. Okay. So, ah, uh, right. Someone wanted uh, those guys, outstanders, Ed, fuel, maybe. We'll see. We're right across the road from getting some f some fuel, so that could be it's possible. It's clear, but I can't really secure this place with a plague heart so close by. Okay, let's get this done. Um. We really want to do that. Okay. Introduce. This doesn't feel like people are living here. Hang on. If there's a play card, it's usually... Alright, maybe they're on the roof. But if there was an enclave here, we wouldn't be able to search it. Not sure exactly what's going on here. We'll check after we've looted it, because if we find a, f a food rack, we need that desperately. Check up on the roof. Oh, Fine, hang on, hang on, fine. hang on. That's Wade's stash. Of course it is. This is Wade's stash, not... <sighs> Getting my missions mixed up. Oh, they're depressed again. Might need to use the lounge. Well, that's about perfect. All right. Don't worry about it, bro. Honestly, we could do with we could do with <laughs> some improvement in morale. However, whatever form that takes. We might pop over there and oh, that's a lot of zombies. If we can get a fuel ruck out of there, that would be great. That's pretty Sledgy. heavy. Big fan of the sledgey. Not always the quickest of heavy weapons to swing. Can catch out. But there are way better. Uh, there are way worse weapons, is what I should say. Uh, we didn't get to trade that out, which means, unfortunately, our car is full. Um, don't even have a... Yeah. A nearby outpost that we could go to. Um, where are these guys... Now there is another gas station down here we could possibly get a um possibly get some fuel. But I got a feeling that those guys maybe won't give us anything in return for that. Alright, but uh Uh-huh. You can walk ten miles if you're careful, but if you run, you probably won't make it to the next block. You know, that's actually good advice right there. And I'm not joking. Especially at night, if you run, you make a lot more noise than what you think you do. Right, we really want a fuel ruck more than we want anything else. We can even leave gas cans behind because we have so many. But they will stack, so we'll take it. Um, moves over to the gas pump that can't be searched. Here we go. Only try and search containers that can be searched. Otherwise, you're just wasting your time and a zombie will bite you in your ass. I don't no think we'll be able that. to carry that. Um, do we drop the... Oh, uh, no. Nope. Not carrying that stupid backpack, so it's not a worry. So, yeah, even here... It takes more resources than you think to fight even, uh, even a handful of zombies. And in a mod like this, where, you know, they quickly escalate... Can run into some tr run into some real trouble now. For this mod, because the last couple episodes 
Like, we've had a lot of zombies, but not, like, loads and loads, like when we started. I was starting to get a bit concerned that maybe I'm installing it wrong. So I followed the instructions to the letter this time. So hopefully, you know, um, do we do that? We also need some materials, man. Okay, uh, right. We can put that in there. That is 10 pounds, 15, 12. <laughs> oh my God, it's the lightest thing. Um, right, well, we'll take all this. Um, we're going to continue and we are going to see these guys. If they shoot at us, then, uh, well, we can't be friends. A little nervous going this close to them. It's easy to screw up that corner, believe it or not. Well, it is for me. Okay, we'll cut across the lake and up to the house. Main thing to watch out for is bloaters in the water. Which sounds so much like a song. Uh oh. Bloaters on the water. Alright, I'll show myself out. People here for the state of decay too, not my crap singing. And murdering of someone's Welcome undoubted morning. classic favourite song. Shoot him before he screams. Might have to do this guy. Yeah, but you got a crossbow, just, uh, you know, not every zombie running in your direction is necessarily coming for you. Tail light out. Lucky we're not in Drucker County. You still making games, Vato? Marquis. Otherwise, we'd have to answer to the Trucker County hey. Highway Patrol. Thank you. Two hundred influence, sure yes, please. Nice looking folks in this town. I think N we'll do just fine here. Nice looking folks. Hope to see you soon. Might as well step inside. I think we can help each other out. Yep. Um. Yeah. Okay. Tell you what, these are all rucksacks that we could use. So I will trade some of this stuff. Oh dear. That's quite a few of them. We'll take That's that. A lot of stuff. Put that in there. And then we'll trade. Probably the ethanol. Yeah, we'll trade that. We'll keep the sledgy. Stay away from them. See here I could go running up the steps. If they probably heard, they'll come smashing through the windows. Oh wow. I'm having problems getting going through portals recently. Oh. I thought it was, you know, life's life's wake up call, but just in games. Right, trade with Conclave. Do some trading. Sure. Yeah, we'll have that. With all this. We'll sell that. They got anything else? No. That's all right then. I didn't have to trade those. Why did I think I had to trade those? I'm confusing myself. Alright, these guys are just seem to be hanging around a little bit, so that's that's all good. Ten pounds. <laughs> Lighter than the sledgehammer. Alright, well we'll just uh we'll just carry that. Right, where do we want to go? So we got Wade Stash, return to deposit, outstanders, they're all the way down there. We've got the gas, so yeah, why don't we do this? We'll do a little bit of scouting as we go. Let's top up our gas. Yeah, it was spilling a bit, but it'll be worth it. Yeah, we, we, we may not be able to afford to stop. So if we're forced into that, even though we've got two gas cans in the trunk, if we can't get them in the car in time, we could be dead meat. And that's all bad. Oh, I've got the, the map marker on again. We've got to turn that on. Is that a vehicle? 
That is a vehicle. Nice. We're a long way from moving into the fire station, but it is one of the better mat uh, bases. And I do like it. It wasn't always my favourite. I have another task for you. Details forthcoming. Hmm, seeing as we're out on the road. His missions are dropping quite nicely. Oh, shit! Okay, I'm going to cheat. Flip the car. Because that was just a... Yeah. Or do we? I'm not sure. I wasn't. I, I, I hadn't decided on whether I was playing that rule. Where if I crash the car, I probably should. Yeah. All right. This is going to get nasty, but it is what it is. So I. Uh, so I'll just park it up here. This is good enough. So, in case you're confused at what I'm doing, a while ago, a while ago, for my No Man's Land series, I decided that if, and, and a previous series, um, if I crash a car and it's my fault, like do something stupid or lose control of the vehicle um, or get it stuck somewhere, then I would have to abandon the car. Or if I flipped it on its roof, I could only flip it back if I had um, a community member or someone enlisted to help me. So uh, that's the situation here. I forgot about it, but what we're actually going to do is play that game. So I'm abandoning this car and I can't use it until I bring back someone either who's enlisted etc in order to uh, flip it on its roof because I use the auto flip function the reason I do that is just because it's not realistic that if you put a car on its roof that you can just stay inside the car and you know flip it back onto its roof again and while I all I did was hit yeah all I did was hit a um a zombie, which is not that much in terms of, you know, collisions. The way that I hit it, it's possible that that could have flipped the vehicle. So I'm going to say that that was legit, and so now I'm on foot. But I have my fuel ruck to talk to these guys, and I have a gas can in case I find another vehicle. So... I'm going to try and get down here and recruit one of these guys to come back with me. And we'll flip it. And then do... Do some more missions. Maybe. Do something. But, yeah. I hope we don't run into any ferals. He heard me. Did he see me? Mm, see? Gone. Oh dear. Did he yell? I think he yelled, yeah. That helps me, buddy. That helps me. Um. Well, okay. Um. Sight can be claimed. Can it? Potential artillery outpost. Tell you what, we haven't really used artillery. Hmm. Let me think about this one. That one. And we could search it for... Um, You could search it for ammunition and guns, but nowhere to put them. Oh, 
tell you what though, I haven't exactly found... Ten times the number, number of zombies yet. Not in a single horde, if you know what I mean. Hey there. Hey Ed, you sound friendly. Gracias, vato. Adios. Uh, that made them friendly. Hey, Excellent. So these guys. I'm looking to do some trading. Cool. Are in fact handy people. You know they're not. Uh, they're not horrible people. Uh, ooh. 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 Oh, it's heavy. We'll come back. Okay, What's going Ali. On, hun? We've got a blank slate. Hey, ¿qué pasa ese? It's pretty useless. And Glad to gr see you're still in one piece. Gremlin. Mechanics. We do need a mechanic. Or we could do with a mechanic. Actually, a blank slate is fine. If we if we recruit Uko, who was that tank from the other place, and teach her mechanics from the auto shop, then we'll be away. So I think that's a better option. Um, so having so said nice that, to see you. Ellie, why don't you come with me? Have you got a gun? I'm not seeing one. He does. Is that a hunter? Isn't great. Uh, that's definitely some sort of shotgun. Good to see you. All right. Um, enlist. You mind helping me out? Lead on. All right, come with me. First thing we're going to do is search the little shed next door. Check it on the map. Oh no, it's been looted. So therefore. Oof. Kill Always that thing for me, you. will you? I'm gonna trade. A bit of bartering. I All keep right. drifting on to... Uh, keep drifting on to threatening this enclave, and I definitely don't want to do that. Okay, the feral's over there, so this way. This way, this way, this way. Now, there is a horde over this side. So... Moving quietly. If the feral hears us, he'll go straight past that community and straight on to us. So we don't want that. The main danger here is that armored zombie. So we'll just get around it. Draw it off that way. No, it didn't work. It worked well enough, though. Alright, Grimman. Come up, you're with me. Wow, running low on crossbow bolts. I don't really want to kill all these dudes. But I don't want them behind me either. Yeah, because all this is just... You know, pushing up the standing. See, that's not ten times a zombie horde. Maybe it's ten times ambient spawns. Or maybe the latest update broke it. Because this is post-update 36 now. Oh, he blinked out. That's different. You know what I think is going to happen. Yeah. Maybe it's like the total number of spawns available are 10 times higher. So we might get, small, you know, the normal size hordes, but just clustered. And then if they, uh, if they spawn on us, then, uh, then they just keep spawning. Because those who have watched from the beginning will remember moving into the first events at the starter base. You know, 50 zombies, probably, that I had to kill. 30, at least. Wherever you see a screamer, the bloater is never far behind.
Alright. Now we've got fire if we need it. Is a screamer. Now we'll just draw them away. Okay. So if we get this back, we'll have Wade's um, mission with the meds. We'll have this materials ruck and a food ruck, which will go a long way. And the mysterious broadcast is there again. Okay. Um. Oh, well, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut our losses. So I'm here with an enlisted uh, enlisted survivor. So I'm gonna say, yep, we managed to flip the car back onto its wheels and we're off again and we've we're hitting the wrong way over there. oh dear oh dear two screamers screaming away get out of here get out of here we don't want them waking up the play carts yeah this car's a bit flimsy it's why i'm keeping the auto shot because if I can recruit that awesome tanky survivor Uko, cool name as well, then uh, then we can give her mechanics and we can upgrade this vehicle. We might need auto mechanics, but hey, I've got the feeling that I'm going to have to need to build a lot of toolkits. Oh, that's right. Around here is just a just a desert. Just full of zombies and disappointment. Sheds full of bitterness. Factories full of lament. Splat. Chipping away at getting our influence up though. That's pretty good. Oh, we forgot to go. Well, we did we forget? Yeah, we did forget to go back and get that um, awesome looking um, upgrade. Plague zombies in all uh, directions. Facility mod for our... I think this is the right way. Yeah, the facility mod for our lounge. Because that would That's be cool. That's a lot of zombies coming in. Yeah. Uh, that's not a play card, is it? It often is. That's a loader. And a jug. check our map no so we're pretty lucky with that I'll be back Drop boom off successful they took the expiration on the mystery truck meat we don't know where they came from yeah mystery meat you say hmm okay so success well done we rule um, that could have gone terribly and didn't. Very good, very good. Let's check uh, our situation. No. So, still losing lots of food. Um, do we go back and get that facility mod? Uh, have we got, yeah, we do have that. Power it up. Are we losing? Oh, dunks. Here we go. And let's gas it up here. I mean, we've got 19, right? So, uh, is this just a level one workshop? How disappointing. Yeah, that's something that we want to change. So we've got all that fuel. So, okay, so we're over here, right? Right? Um, we've got this ammo site, which we can clear out. Plus, they had the uh, facility mod. Um, they're friendly. And there might be some other opportunities around here for more materials. Yeah, definitely that place. Yeah, I think we're going to return. But with a better crossbow. Or with more crossbow bolts, anyway. Boom, boom. 
mean it's not a lot of crossover bolts however however you look at it um so yeah let's just uh, check out no. salvage beast auto works so plus 30 percent fuel efficiency that is working for me at the moment there's probably a cor correlation between that and having so many gas cans still um improved toolkits so we can craft bulk which is 200 for three which is two-thirds the cost so that's that's pretty good that's a third saving if we build versus building them one at a time yeah, so i i do work. like that hmm let's turn that on i should have done that ages ago got water in here ah uh, infirmary two we should make some craft some painkillers that'll help with chemistry boom and we can afford it so if we look at this now we've got 12 that feels a lot better so considering where we're going and that we've got four stims for when we take on the next play card we'll take energy drinks and we will top up our pistol it's in average shape we'll repair it it's not something that we want to run out of and uh okay gremlin you're with me we're heading back to your home well gremlin it's good that you were here boom <laughs> There's, that's the rules. If I do that, like on another part of the map, and there's no one around to help me, yeah, I have to abandon order. the vehicle. I should have done it immediately, but I kind of, uh, yeah, I um, I kind of for, uh, forgot or momentarily faltered on employing that rule. You see, I'm doing two series at the at the moment, and in conjunction with this one, I'm doing one on the No Man's Land mod, and it is so brutal. It is so brutal. The brutality just stacks up one series after the other, I tell you. Grind you down, and in the end you whimper like a little pansy in front of your your obstacles. But no, we, we, we put it right, I think. I think we put it right. And because it hadn't happened in the series... And I wasn't sure whether I was going to be as serious in this series as I was going to be in the No Man's Land mod. I think it's easier just to play the way I want to play. Wow, went blank for a second. Um, which is to keep it as realistic as possible. Did we come back this way? Not sure. Stop doing that. Actually, if, sh if my follower kills them with the door, I'm not sure whether that uh, contributes significantly or at all towards um, uh, towards awakening a heart. Yeah, so these, these lighter vehicles, much. you've got to watch out for their uh, vehicle stability if you're playing the way that I do. Can cause problems. Right. Pedal down. Let's go. Brake pedal down. We're at our location. How would you rate your trip? Right now, one good thing about having uh, Gremlin coming around with me is if I find anything that I don't really need, I can trade it directly with her, which is which is good. That won't be ammo. We will be keeping all the ammo. Thank you. Yummy, yummy ammo. Even 357. I mean, we've got a revolver which uh, which uses 357. But you get rifles and pistols. Magazine-fed pistols which use 357 as well. They're rare, nice. but you can use them. Arctic Warrior. Okay. Bolt action rifle. Powerful. 762. This is great progress for our base. Is it? 
Are people still de oh, people are still de depressed? Oh, not as depressed. Uh, no. All right. Well done. Take a break. Yikes. Um, yeah, we're fine. Back we go. Just got to watch out that we don't have screamers or anything closing in on us. This looks like the kind of place you might find a... Uh, um, hidden... Oops. Weapons chest kind of thing. Oh, where is that? Is that outside? Oh, wow. Okay, that's different. Although over the over time, I haven't found oh, that greater stuff, and not like it used to be in the good old days. Just check the way it's clear. It should be, but you never know. All right. And it's probably some stuff that we can... Uh, we need to... Yeah, we need to put some stuff in, don't we? Yeah, that's, that's what the situation called for exactly. Okay, we'll drop the 357 for now, because we want to trade with these guys. Crossbow. Alright, we are not running because there is a feral around here. We're running at pace will alert it to our presence. And those guys. Well, there was a feral around here. Any rate, not going to risk it. What's going on, hun? I think Give we can me help each other out. Of course. That. Going far with all this. And that. It's just influence, folks. It's just influence. All right. Where is he? Didn't come down this end because it's closer to the road. But I had a feeling. Can't keep this up. Oops. Could have set things off right there. You don't have stealth or anything. You don't really you don't totally need it. At least early game lethal zone. But I would very much recommend what's that? 25 pounds, 12 pounds. Boom. And ammo. And let's get this stuff back to base. Yeah, very, very much recommend having at least one character with stealth in your community. If you have a large community, a little trick that I used to use back in the day. Um, when I, like you know, struggled to tell who was who and what, what their jobs were, you know, what their function was in the community beyond just what their fifth skill was, was I used to give my tank, so the, my guys with things like endurance and powerhouse or combination of both, etc., I would give them the cowboy hat. And then for my stealth, I would all give them knit caps. And then that way I could just very quickly go through and go, okay, how many tanks have I got? How many stealth have I got? Because those two generally, you know, you got a tank for taking on hearts and big problems, and then you got your stealth for repairing all the damage and uh, fueling those rampaging tank runs, which uh, which you're sometimes inclined to do. So that's a way that you can do it if you're into changing up your closets. I generally don't these days, um, and I don't know why. It's not that the closet isn't cool. There is some cool stuff in there, but I, I just, I guess, maybe it's because of content creation. I, I just think that's not what people want to see. 
But if I'm wrong, let me know in the comments. If you want to see me dress up my characters, I am more than willing to do so if there is uh, enough appetite for me to do this. In the middle of the apocalypse, when everything's going on and everything's cranked up as hard as it can be, that'll be us. Uh, is this us? I'm lost. No. No, that is not us. If I take out the nearest plague heart, this, this might is us. clear up. Uneven ground, so we're going to be careful. Flipping your car too much. When you hit uneven ground, just take your finger off the accelerator. It's enough for the car to balance out. You know, it kind of flattens out and puts its weight back down on the wheels. Okay, we've got a fight. We've got a fight right now. Here he comes. Get inside. Yeah. He was that close. Uh, yeah. About the best I've got. I'll take those. I'll take that. Oh no, he backed off. That's good, that's good. Can I have that bloater from there? Got him! <laughs> oh, that's got to be a record. That's got to be a record. Look at them swarm over there. Did you see that? They're like all over there checking it out. Dude, where did, where did that shot come from? All right, that's enough. Let's put this stuff away because we are bang tired. Pick a gun and you know what? Shotgun is great. So we'll give him the KSG back. Give him his bandage, his single bandage back. Um, maybe we should make some more bandages. Ah, we're okay. We're okay. All right. Um, he's got a melee weapon and stuff. He's using a Bowie machete. Nothing but the best for this guy. And if he's going to do that, we'll give him a parang because look how lethal it is. Oh, that's just as lethal. But it's got a bit, bit better dismemberment. There we go. Right. Plan. Mysterious broadcast. Uh, oh, yeah, maybe. I think we tried that before and it all went incredibly badly wrong. But we could give it another go. We've got some help. Or someone we can sacrifice. It depends on your point of view. Jamar. I've always got someone with bartending in the community who's just the bee's knees. Um, okay, Wade's knackered. We don't even have a garden. That's a, that's uh, the no. thing, though. Even with the lounge. Well, we'll put this in for now because we are managing. What we need is two new food outposts. Where might we get those? Governor. Um... Yeah, these guys are in the in the fog up here. Uh, that's an ammo shop, it's a factory. Probably getting down towards big territory over there. Down this way, we might get lucky. No, let's see. That's a food store there. But if that's red, this is going to be red, and it's pretty gnarly down there anyway. Um, could we get a safe house, maybe? For extra three beds or I mean more materials more materials would be good um do we do it do we make the run it's not far it's not far we do need to train up a few people don't we Adrian hey Adrian could be a um he could be a mechanic also have we got a mechanics book? Just just out of the blue. Have we got one? Nope. Okay. So Yo, anyone wanna step up and lead us? Or should we just all keep running around doing our own thing? That's true. Okay, we've got a warlord or a sheriff. 
Now, for this series, I'm, uh, we could go Lounge 3 with the Sheriff. What do you think? Max out the... Max that out. He did pretty well. Then we get a field hospital, but we haven't really got the base for that. Unless we get rid of the auto. Yeah, the, it is a bit of a luxury, isn't it? But until we... Uh, must be at home to use. Can't be used. Already has a communa. Can't be used if a survivor. Right. That's 150 and 200 influence. Right, honestly, if we get that, then we can... Then we can trash it. For 30% fuel efficiency. Then we can look at building, what, a farm? Then that'll cost eight for a farm. Start reducing our, our food. Okay, Adrian. It's getting too crowded. We need more room or fewer people. If we did that, then that could be the field hospital. Or it could start off with a farm. We could come... Mm. That's our still. Alright, so if we're here... Learn mechanics. This place would really rock if we had some electricity. Craft. Upgrade kits. Medium. Upgrade kit. Oh, we could do that. So if we... Ah, uh, no, but we need auto mechanics. Okay. All right, well, fine. Here we go. We're learning mechanics. Um, and so that means that... Oh, yeah. What is this? Oof. Yeah, I want to keep that. I really do. We might be losing the lounge at some point. Hit me up in the comments. Think you tell me what you think I should do with this. I'd quite like to use a trader. Not for the trader outpost, because I never use them. But just because I haven't used one in a while. Can we take this guy? He's nearly uh what's he's a warlord as well. Um Warlord Trader Shooting two stars. Oh dude. Um, shaky hands sometimes waste ammo. You know, dude, I'm not a big fan of you. You got plus five max health there. But he's a hero. These two are heroes. This guy's Mr. Expendable. Our vehicle isn't expendable, though. So let's send Adrian. Yep. Adrian, you're up. And let's give him a decent backpack. Let's equip him with enough to make sure that he comes back alive. Uh, is that a classic? That's a classic. So we'll take those two crossbow bolts as well. It'll make all the difference, I am sure. Uh, where's that pistol? Yeah, it's actually pretty good. I like it. Take one of those. Branding iron. It's pretty heavy, but it's durable. And it's lethal, and it's blunt. So, yeah, we're happy with that. And just in case we end up in trouble, we'll take those. Take a gas can for the vehicle. All right. Perhaps we should be hitting play card now. Perhaps we should. Oh, come on. These guys are very fragile. But the thing is, if we do this echo mission, we might find some incredible guns. And who doesn't want incredible guns, right? Uh, we got anything we can do here. Let's, let's, that's plus three noise. We're, we're okay. We'll do that. Have a party. We'll be back. I'll be back.
Hopefully. Alright, we might go a slightly different direction and continue scouting the map. My cat is snoring. It's clear for now. It's very it cute. Be long until the kind of off back in. Right. Boom, boom. So past this barn. Always good to check out a barn and just scout it out because they often have a we lot a of loot in them. You know, sometimes two rucks, crossbows, weapons, parts, all of that sort of thing. Chemicals, they got it all. So it's good to scout past them if you can and just kind of check, is there a play card in there? Is it lootable? If not, you know, and you've got one run to make on the map, that's all you've got the resources to do, then that's the one that you do. All right, it's a good idea to do this one in daylight at the start because we could do this and get back and be primed for a heart. Colonial zombie. All right, is it somewhere down here? Damn, that play yeah. hard smell is fucking rancid. Sure is. I'm hoping that didn't count as a uh, as awakening heart. What we'll do is we'll just uh, drive up here where no one will ever find us ever. Actually, that's not a bad spot at all. Complete accident, but there you go. Oh, shh. Right. So, one second. Right, so, problem here is that if we burn them, we will wake up play cards. Because uh, when they catch on fire, they wake up. And so then when they die, they all count towards waking the play cart. I found that out the hard way. I'll take him out. He's a major threat. Watch that stinky stuff. Maybe if they're below the clouded. They will they will explode and die. For science! Fire Ah, there you go, folks. There you go. We learned something, and knowledge is power. So it turns out that if there, if the uh, zombies are hanging around bloater cloud, and you Where? burn the bloater cloud, that will annihilate the zombies, and they won't um, have a chance to wake up will become alert before they die and thus wake up a nearby play cart. Brilliance. That is really good to know. We got lucky though. One of the zombies survived. There could have been more. You know, momentarily. Survived the initial blast. And while we're up here, we should survey. Or that's... Alright, let's have a look. You are bloater. Screamer. Just say what you Another see, Guru. Plague heart. Wake up. Fire Chief's house. Can't be it. Yeah, nothing more to see here. Right. Okay. What does that turn up? What does that look like? Nothing great. Um, mysterious broadcast. Aha. Uh -huh. There it is up there. Okay. There's another site up there as well. Excuse me, Grimman. If I fall off here, I'm going to kill you. Come on. Just uh, avoid that fella. Play games completely. Hey, All right. Can you send someone over? We have a deal you should hear. 
Crusty townies. They actually seem like pretty handy kind of people. Um, right, so if we look... Trusty townies are there. Okay. Yeah, we could um, we could help them out after we've done this. It's kind of on the way. We're on a kind of a bit of a roll at the moment. So even though I want to take on a play cart right now, I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. I'm just going to throw up missions which could lead to positive outcomes. Why not? The zombies aren't being problematic, so whatever the uh, deal is with the spawns, they're not creating a problem at the moment. saw he got shot uh oh get up i mean yes good need to crouch of course if you crouch so does your uh, follower that can lead to some pretty unpleasant outcome sometimes that's nice um of course we'll take that um, drop that. We don't need it. Um, we appreciate your results in this matter. Okay, we'll drop that. Actually, we should be able to trade it. Why are we dropping it? Why are we dropping this stuff when we can just trade it? Huh? Huh? Something on your mind? What you yes. got for me? Sure. Why am I so dumb? Um, we will. Hmm. I'm almost tempted to trade the blood plague cure. Um, oh, those will stack. That's cool. Just about. Uh, advance break. Blade break. Something on your mind? What's up? Get get us. Okay. Ouch, that hurt. Echo one wraith. We do have blade users. Advanced break? We'll be okay without a break. Here's a bunch of stuff I scavenged. You saw it here first, folks. Okay, that's done, scout these up, now we'll stealth kill these guys just to keep building wits, okay say, so, right, is that something we trigger? 25% skill improvement. Hey, that's actually pretty good, isn't it? Let's keep doing that. Let's keep that lounge cranking. I guess we could have put some stuff in the car. <laughs> I guess we could have and then come back. But nah. It's all right. It's all good. Don't worry about it. We got 100. We got 100 for a play cure. Oh, these are, these guys are the cannibals, aren't they? They're going to ask me to uh, go find them a cleaver or something like that. Tell you what, though, we got a lot of food. Are we on the right way here? I don't think we are. We could be. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe, 
Nope. We'll see if we can find a um, a shortcut. No, I don't think I've been up this way. Look around. That's a little shortcut, isn't it? Huh. Here's a gap. I never knew that. All right. Um, I could do with a vehicle with a bigger trunk. That's for sure. are a little too friendly if you ask me yeah something's yeah not right. something's not right yeah these guys are, are cannibals i am sure oh hey take it easy Who do we need to talk to mark yes that's right um let us forget about it either one thing red talent likes to likes to do is tell you how how well they're doing all right there we go so we don't have to resort to cannibalism yet by the time they come just kidding yeah. wouldn't it be funny if you got sick I'm thinking we got a plague heart nearby uh, thinking materials, materials, materials down here on the way back, maybe. And up that lane will be a house with a play card in it, almost certainly. There's a factory across the road down here. There's a pretty good chance of having some materials in it. If we can get a run on it. It's looking clear. Clear enough. Yeah, it's us. Get it. Screamer coming in. Alright. Is it looted? It's freaking looted. Um, alright. How we're we doing for time. Well, this episode is pushing on a little bit anyway. Let's get this stuff back to base. We've done all right. It wasn't the most awesome find in the world in terms of echo guns, but we'll keep doing them because one day we might get another Echo S3 shotgun, which is just my new favorite shotgun ever. It's a pressed shotgun. It's just awesome. Well, well, well. Gotcha. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Getting low on that. Okay. Doesn't sound good. Probably could do with a bigger caliber weapon than that, right? Perfect. I might bring some 
bring friends in. Oh, yeah. We have brought friends in. We might go for something else. We reach out. Dang it, can't. This could be... Oh, there she is. Oh. He's on. <laughs> it's all on. No more of those. Come with me, big guy. We just want to just keep him away from our main members, our main crew, because they should be fine against these dudes. Fucking be. But did we leave that big gun in the car? That's what we want. Seeing your shots on him. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Yes. Let's not celebrate too soon, huh? What are you doing, bro? Hello. Take care, I say. <laughs> he's going, Magnus, he's going psycho on them. Deb, get your butt back inside this base. Right now, we uh, we shot someone here, didn't we? Disappeared. Probably despawned in order to make room for more zombies. So that was a good spawn. Still. Okay, so we didn't get whatever she was carrying. Um, okay, Zeb. Before you get eaten, I think we'll call the episode there. Not bad, not bad at all. Um, right, probably next episode will take on a heart seeing as we've got the we've got the gear for it now and things are relatively stable we've got a mechanic so we can fix our car um yeah we've got stims we've got some new guns we haven't got a lot of crossbow bolts but hey if we take on a um a heart we should get some more um good stuff and if we can start pushing down the road into this area then you know we uh open these up to building outposts and the like so let's look forward to that, eh? Outstanders, oh, they want more fuel. Again, that would make them happy. Still, 
and Wade wants to stash in the bar. Okay, these missions are just flipping up. So we haven't got time for them today. Hopefully they'll turn up for the next episode and I hope to catch you for that one. Wherever in the world you are, please go in peace. Take care of yourself. See you for the next one. Ka kite. Bye for now.